right, good morning. We are at Laburnum Elementary. I'm Mr. Gillenwater. Some people call me Coach G. We are in physical education. This is kindergarten class. This is Ms. Delano's class. And today we are going to learn some science in physical education. Okay, we've been learning about this all week in your classroom, and we're going to integrate it today in our PE lesson. All right, class, today's goal is animal habitats. Animal habitats. This is what we're going to learn about, okay? Okay, the what, why, and the how. The what, what are we going to learn? Starts with the letter H. Habitats. Habitats, okay. Why? Why do we learn habitats so we know where animals live? Okay. How many habitats by raise of hand can you tell me that there are? King, how many are there? You gotta give me a number. One, two, three, four. He says four. Raise your hand if you think he's right. I think he's right. I think he's right. Okay, so how? How can I get to the correct habitat? We're gonna learn how to do that because today in PE, you are going to move like an animal. Okay, you're gonna move like an animal in here to get to the right habitat. Now, in the gym, we have four habitats. If you look around the gym here, you'll see these white pieces of paper on the wall. Now, we're gonna have four. Okay, by raise of hand, who can tell me what this habitat is? Not I'm looking for a raised hand. Front row, what is it? Um, ocean. She says ocean. Okay, that is one habitat. By raise of hand, who can tell me what this habitat represents? All the way over there. The desert. The desert. Okay, everybody agree? A lot of sand, a lot of sun, very hot, very dry. This is a pretty tricky one. Let me go back here. Arctic. Arctic. That's a really big word, right? Arctic. All right. Arctic. Can you tell me what the Arctic looks like if you were there? Would it be hot? No, it would be cold. Would it be icy? Would you see a snowman? You might. All right. We got one more to look at. This is a, ah, uh, looking for a raised hand. I'm looking for somebody I've never called on before. Right here, right underneath you. He says rainforest. Now look, we got woods, we got trees, okay? A lot of vegetation going in here. All right, so we got habitats around the gym, four corners in here. It's a square. And we have a few pictures here to help us know where we're going and what we're looking at, okay? Over here is desert. Everybody point to the desert. desert. See the sun coming through the window? It's very hot. Yeah. All right, look behind over here. Can somebody tell me what that says? Rainforest. 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 Very good. Starts with the letter R. Okay, to my right, this starts with the letter O. What is this? An ocean. Ocean. And All the way over there in that corner starts with the letter A. What is that? Arctic. All right, I need a little help here, man. I need a little help. I'm going to give you a picture. I'm going to get some people to help me here. Okay. These waves right here. This is water. Where do you think this goes? Um, beside the ocean. Beside the ocean. Okay. I'm going to get you to go over there and tape it against the ocean. All right. That's going to help us know where to go. All right, and this is a picture of a what? Boat. boat! Where do you think a boat would go, in the desert? No. Oh. No. Ocean. All right, I'm gonna get you to take it to the ocean. Tape it on the wall. Once you tape it, you come back. All right, what is this right here? Is that an iceberg? Yeah. 
You think it goes to the Arctic? Yeah. I think you're right. Let me get somebody up here to go tape it. All right, go tape it on the Arctic. Show us where the Arctic is. Hmm, let me find a good one. Mm, 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 level zero. All right, what is this? Rainforest! Woo! How do you know it's a rainforest? All right, let me get, who said they want to do the rainforest? Keen, go put that in the rainforest. Show us where the rainforest is. We don't have to do all these. All right, this is a good one here. All right, somebody raise your hand. Tell me what this is. What is it? He says desert. All right, we got the sun, we got cactus, and you're going to show us where the desert is in the gym. You go put that where the desert is, all right? All right. Once he does that and comes back, Good job. Let's make sure we got them in the right spot. Arctic, rainforest, desert, ocean. So we got our four habitats. Now, like I said today in PE, we're going to do two things. We're going to move like an animal. All the animals are going to be different. And you're going to walk like an animal to the correct habitat. All right? So I'm going to do the first one with you so you know what to do. So here's what we're going to do. All right, this is the first one. For example, somebody raise their hand, tell me what this animal is. I'm looking for a raised hand. It's a kangaroo. Now, do kangaroos use their front arms? They do. To move around, they use their what? They use their feet, they use their legs. Now. When we use our legs in PE, I like to get down low like this, put my arms low, then I can jump up like this. Kind of like a frog hop when we did that. Right? Now, if I was a kangaroo, just point to it, point to where you think a kangaroo would live. Where was its habitat? Point to where in the gym you think a kangaroo would live. I ain't going to tell you this one. Point two. I might give you a hint. The desert. All right, so here's what we're going to do as a class. I want everybody, we're not touching, but I want you to hop like a kangaroo to the desert and then hop back. Can you do that? All right, let me see some hopping feet. Hop to the desert and then hop back and come to your circle. Hop back, let me see some hopping legs. All right, we should be setting crisscross in three, two, one. All right, very good. All right, that's the example. From now on out, you're on your own. By raise of hand, she's got her hand raised, I like it. Tell me what that animal is. You did, I think you said it. <coughs> polar bear. Yeah. Okay. Now the word polar tells me where that goes, but I'm gonna show you how a polar bear works. Let me show you how a polar bear walks. Don't do it, just watch. So I'm on my hands, I'm on my feet, I'm gonna take long strides. See that? Are polar bears fast? Not really. If I was a polar bear, if I was a polar bear, point to where you think a polar bear would live. Oh, they got 
Now you're going to have to walk to where you think a polar bear would live. Go ahead and walk like a polar bear to it. We're on our feet. We're on our hands. Now we're going to walk back. Walk back like a bear. Walk back like a bear. All right, everybody should be on a circle in three, two, one. Come back over, man. All right, hey, remember, when we go to these habitats, is it a race? No. It's not a race. It's not a race, okay? So you don't have to go fast. Do not go fast, because someone might get what? Someone might get bumped. We gotta be careful at the same time. You gotta be careful, okay? I'm looking for a raised hand on the next one. He says shark. When I make a shark, I like to do this. I like to put a fin above my head like this. You're gonna go back and forth. You're gonna zigzag back and forth. I'm not going to tell you where to go like a shark. You're going to have to figure this out on your own. But remember, we're not running. We're not bumping into each other. Okay. Swim like a shark to the habitat where you think it lives. Come on back. Mm, be careful. Slow down. Slow down. All right, everybody is setting in three. Slow down. Two. One. Make sure you hey. Make sure you walk and then you set. Don't slide, okay? That was a little bit too fast, guys. Sharks don't run that fast, man. All right. Now everybody went to the ocean. Could a shark also live in the Arctic? No! Why not? There's water there. So that means some people could have went to the ocean, and if you went to the Arctic, that'd be okay too. So some animals have more than one habitat. So, this is a parrot. Now look around the parrot. What's around the parrot by raise of hand? Leo, what's around this parrot? Uh, what's these things? What's it standing on? Stars of the letter T. These are trees. Now think about this when we look for habitats. So, we're up going to see walking feet. You're going to fly to the habitat where you think this bird lives. And then fly back to me. Can you do that? Do not touch each other. Walking feet. You're going to fly to the habitat and then fly back. Let me pick someone that's never answered it before. You want to go back. He's got his hand raised. I like that. All right, what's this animal? A camel. Now the camel, camel's got this big bump on his back. Check this out. By raise of hand, can somebody tell me what the camel has in this big hump? You think you know the answer, Leo? A hump. It's a hump, but what's inside of this hump? Because this desert's hot, it needs this to survive. Starts with the letter W. Water. All right, when we walk like a camel, here's what I want you to do. You're on your hands, you're on your feet, but I want to see that hump in your back. See that? I want to see a little hump in your back if you can do it. Camels are slow, they don't run. All right, walk to the environment, walk to the habitat where a camel would live. 
Oh, mercy. Now look, these frogs right here are not gonna hop fast. We're not gonna hop into each other, but you gotta hop to the right habitat. Remember the frog hop. We go low like this, jump up with two feet. All right, frog hop to a frog's habitat. Go. We're hopping. Don't want to see walking, I want to see hopping. Oh, this is, this is my favorite one right here. Everybody knows this is a, it's a crab. Remember we played a sport? Remember we played a sport? Hey, I need level zero, level zero, level zero. Remember when we played crab soccer, we walked like a crab. All right, let me show you again. Let me show you a crab walk. Let me show you. I'm on my hands, I'm on my feet, and I'm walking like a crab. It is easy. All right, show me where a crab would live and crab walk back. It's pretty hot for a crab, man. Crab walk back, crab walk back. Crab walk, we're crab walking, we're crab walking. You're cheating. Last one, you get to pick your own habitat. <laughs> this one's just for fun. So you can move like any animal you wanna move like. Move like any animal we, we just learned. Go to a habitat, move back. All right, go. All right, come back, bring it back, bring it back. All right, everybody is back on a circle in five seconds, four, three, two, and one. We are setting crisscross. We're setting crisscross. Setting crisscross. You all right? Just throw it in the garbage, man. All right, everybody's sitting crisscross. Hands behind our head. Eyes are closed. We are breathing. Slow, deep breaths. We're not talking. Ah, we're not talking. All right. Put your hands on your knees. Still not talking. This is just a funny picture. This is not a real animal, all right? It's a shark for us. Anyways, so we learned habitats. We learned about animals in habitats, where they live. We have four habitats. And not all animals can live in all habitats, right? Some of them can, some of them can't. Cool. Thank you for joining us at Laburnum Elementary with my kindergarten class, Ms. Delano's class, where we learned about habitats and the animals who live in those habitats, and we got to move like those animals as well. All right. Oh.